What's up everybody, it's Skytune, and welcome to the unboxing of Kirby in the Forgotten Land and Ghostwire Tokyo. Now since both of the games are releasing on the same day, I thought, let's just make one video. So on this one video, be sure to leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and let's get into it. So we're gonna start off with Kirby. There's the front, and on the back, it says, feast your eyes on a wild world of 3D platforming action. Copy enemy abilities, then transform them in different ways. Change shape and explore by inhaling cars, rings, cones, and more. And if you look down here, it does offer amiibo support and includes co-op play, so you can play with a friend. Oh, that's actually really nice. It's just Kirby in mouthful mode, zooming on the highway to the city. And then right here is the game cartridge. Now on to the next game, Ghostwire Tokyo. I was actually lucky enough to secure a steelbook, so let's start with that. Here's the front of it, and here's the back. It looks like this is one of those gates, and then we have a bunch of different symbols up at the top. On the inside, it shows the whole neon lit city of Tokyo. All right, all right, so now the actual game. Here's the front of it, you can see this creepy guy, which I think that's the boss of the game. And back here is Slenderman holding an umbrella and a headless girl. Yeah, I probably should have mentioned this before, but Ghostwire Tokyo is a horror game. So it's not exactly considered horror, but it has some creepy aspects to it, which technically makes it a horror game. But it's rated T for teen, so it can't be that bad. All right, on the back it says, face the unknown. Tokyo's population has vanished and deadly supernatural forces prowl the streets. Use an arsenal of elemental abilities to unravel the truth behind the disappearance and save Tokyo. Action-packed single player adventure Explore a beautifully haunted Tokyo and powerful supernatural abilities. And then the deluxe edition, the one that I got, includes a weapon and some outfit packs. All right, so this is probably where my code is for all the exclusive stuff. And then here's the disc. Oh, and there is something behind that little piece of paper. Let's check this out. So on this page, it gives you the controls of all the different actions in the game. Well, that was the unboxing of these two awesome new games. I hope you enjoyed. I will be streaming both of them on Twitch, but Kirby and the Forgotten Land expect some gameplays, kind of like the Pokemon Legends Arceus gameplays that are still releasing right now. Expect gameplays for Kirby in the Forgotten Land. If you don't already follow me on Twitch, click the link down below and be sure to do that. All my other links are down below as well. And if you enjoyed this video, be sure to comment, like, subscribe, share, turn on your notifications, and I'll see you in the next one.